go and I'm giving you my word that AB will put on a spectacular performance. It's easy to say, but uh, hard to do. To do it. We really meant to say is it's easy to say, but we're gonna him up, punch him in his eye, kick him his nuts. That short is going down. That's what he really meant to say. And I guarantee, I'm guaranteeing that he will send Manny back to the Senate beltless. Thank you. What you really meant to say, man? That's a bullshit. He gonna really f this boy up. I mean, <laughs> send him back to the hood, knock him the f out, change his life. I just feel like y'all trying to play me for real. Floyd is retired, man. I feel like y'all just know trying to throw me in there to the wolves. This shit ain't right, man. It's not easy to to uh, to work on this uh, kind of event. To give the fans uh, yeah, a stop good fight and, and 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 the boy is broke. He go he bought out a jewelry that's fake. But you 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 be talking too much about me on me. Yeah, you nigga. I'ma let you know. Okay, that's fine. Well, Kevin, what do you say to all us? He's done. All right. Um, in the ring. Man, that's the way you meant. Man, you said Brunner is a f***ing freak, he's a pervert. He's gonna try to touch his foot and touch his in his ring. He's gonna f*** up when he see him. <laughs> hey, thanks for your time, champ. I appreciate it. And it's time for the face-off between the two fighters. Let's get that going and that'll end the festivities. Oh, hello. <laughs> How's it going, man? No, no, I'm not bothered, but it's kind of uh, challenging to me, you know. When people are saying that uh, money is gone, no more. I, what I want right now is just to maintain my name in the top and until I'm, I'm, I'm going to hang up my gloves finally and retire. And, and after that, uh, you know, retire as a, as a winner. All of you, media, press. You help a lot. Because of you, we became known all over the, the world. Because of you guys, media, for, for helping us, you know. You're part of my journey. You're part of, of, my, of my success. Abner Morris tells me you are the best fighter in history. Uh, thank you. Thank you for... Uh, uh, it's an honor. Um, but there's a lot of mo also uh, best fighters in, in, in the world. So not only me. Adrian Broner weighs in at 146 and one half pounds. WBA welterweight champion of the world, Manny Pacman Pacquiao. 146 pounds, 146 for the champion. I say, I think Broner beats him. Yeah? He's had a great career. Well, guess what? He's at the end of it. This might be his last fight. And it could be a situation where he's in the right place at the right time, and he beats Pacquiao, who's 40 years old.
you think about the amount and ability to throw so many punches at the age of 40? I'm so happy because uh, God gave me this uh, good health, these blessings. Although uh, I want to be aggressive more, but uh, my camp is, uh, my coach uh, told me that uh, do not be careless, just uh, wait him. I really don't believe that my career is over. Manny Pacquiao's journey is still uh, continue. See that nigga there? Got me a blue face tonight. Devontae was beat the shit out of me. Oh, they say AB won. I hope AB won. Who won? Who won? Bro? Who won the fight? Pacquiao won the fight? Pacquiao? <laughs> Yo, AB, call me, bro. Please tell me y'all playing with me. Pacquiao won the fight? Yo, Pacquiao won for real? I got the whole hood with me. H O O D. They keep talking about a Floyd and Pacquiao too. And he ain't gonna get past me. She, <laughs> she, <laughs> I feel like a bum trying to fight for a sandwich. I swear to God. He's fast. Uh, seem fast with his uh, uh, mouth. Big drama show. Big drama show. Manny Pacquiao, his journey is still uh, continue. Pacquiao was all over him. Hell no, he did not. He did not win that fight. You don't throw punches, man. He went up there and said that he felt like he won the fight. Well, uh, yeah, he's kind of like delu delusional. I, I did expect more from Adrian Broner. It was a one sided fight. And Broner just came to survive, you know? Man, he did win, and he won clearly. I can be honest, he didn't win the fight. Pacquiao's one of them humble beasts. <laughs> he's he, he stayed for the 12 rounds. That's very hard to do at 40 years old. He stayed very strong for, for 12 rounds, and that's very hard. I mean, very hard. I think I gave him like two rounds. By the 12th round, Pacquiao was all over him and had him running. Pacquiao. Why? Yeah, Pacquiao's already a Hall of Famer, man. You know, I don't know why he's still fighting. <laughs> I like this new generation of music. I think about the fight. I beat him. Everybody out there know I beat him. <laughs> We'd love it, Manny. Because um, he wants me to sing. <laughs> he's 21. He's 21. Didn't do anything tonight. He could catch a Pacquiao. <laughs> oh, look at Jeff. He, what the oh, heck? Oh, wow. Oh. Look, Manny. If he thinks he won, then he won. A uh, Manny. Ah, uh, Pacquiao. The winner won. What you mean? Man, Manny, Manny won. Broner said he won. No disrespect to Broner. He kind of ran. So Manny oh, wanted to fight clear. Man, come on, Jeff. I think I think Broner won one a half of a round. Oh uh, yeah, Manny won. No, no disrespect to AB, but man, he didn't win the fight. <laughs> Manny Pacquiao, like nine to three. Uh, I firmly believe Manny Pacquiao won the fight. If you ask me, I feel like I won the fight. <laughs> it's time to cash checks and have sex, man. <laughs> he lives in that alternate universe world. That's comfortable for him. They said that, oh, well, Garcia won because Broner didn't train, always with the excuses. And now, now that he loses against a 40-year-old Pacquiao, well, f no, he won that fight. I mean, Jesus Christ. I'm gonna go back and watch the fight. Man, what's up, man? Uh, give me your reaction. You and f boxing, brother. <laughs> Fuck boxing, are you done boxing? You know I retired. I didn't know that, man. You're, are you are you retired from boxing? I'm no. dead ass, brother. What are you gonna do now? Huh? What are you doing now? If not Sell boxing? bricks, man. Come on, man. Turn up, turn on Fortnite and play it now. Put on the Fortnite. Get Fortnite now.
together? Does that fight have to happen? Do you feel like your career would feel incomplete if you didn't have the rematch with Floyd? Mm, I never thought that I lost that fight. To have a rematch is to, to answer those uh, questions in our minds, and especially the, 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 the fans. To have uh, brother before uh, me with it because of uh, similar stuff. Have you been given assurances that if you beat Adrian Broner, that the Mayweather rematch would be next in 2019? Uh. Tough to say. Tough to say. Tiago se ve más completo que Floyd. Está menos lastimado. Floyd se ve su velocidad. Tiene mucho que desear. Se ve diferente la pelea. Totalmente. Pacquiao last night and verbally agreed to a rematch in December. What is your take on that? Good luck to them. I don't want any involvement in it. Mayweather and Pacquiao are hardly in their prime. But he did what he had to do. He got the win. He looked good. I don't know, bro. Um, but you know, when it's time to sell a fight, I know what I gotta do. It's money made money. Talking about selling a fight, I gotta ask you about Manny Pacquiao this past weekend. Did you get a uh, chance to look chance, at it? I had, had, had a chance to see Manny Pacquiao. Uh, you gonna, uh, are you gonna come back and fight Manny Pacquiao? Like I said before, we did what we had to do. I won, he had excuses. It's specific that you feel is still left, or there's still a goal that you have in mind. Pretty much with me, with their. That's easy to, to discuss after this uh, Saturday fight. Well, uh, I'm still here in boxing, so if you want to come back, then come back and then uh, let's face each other in the ring. Floyd Mayweather, will you fight him next? Well, Do you want that fight? Tell him to come back to, uh, to the ring and then uh, we will fight. Uh, if he's, he's, he's willing to come back in boxing. Floyd, you're staying out of the ring, but we got a camera there. Are you going to accept that challenge? A simple nod will do. Yes or no, Floyd? No reaction? He might fight Manny, might not. If he does come back to fight anyone, it would be wise to come back to fight Manny, you know? I mean, these other young guys, are, that's probably biting off a little more than you can chew. I only want to see Pacquiao fight Floyd and get out because nobody else should be fighting. <laughs> How are you doing? This man gave me uh, his boxing gloves 15 years ago. <laughs> I, I still have them in my living room. I have many Pacquiao's. I have uh, uh, Hagler. I have Muhammad Ali. And I have Joe Frazier. Those are my boxing gloves that I have. Wow. It's a pretty good collection, right? <laughs> if the team fight breaks out, you're on our side. <laughs> in course, Floyd Mayweather out of retirement for a rematch. L let me tell you the story, uh, the real story. I didn't know that Floyd Mayweather was there. I just wa I just invited, and she knows that Floyd is here. Floyd, yeah? Over there, over there. <laughs> when I'm throwing a, um, a t-shirt uh, to the crowd, and I, I saw him, and I just sh shake, him, shake hand with him and say hello. Welcome back to Andy Staples Baker. Center. Manny Pacquiao in the house. Filipino Heritage Night, throwing socks out to the crowd and saying hello to the, oh me, oh my. I wondered if Mayweather would be here. They meet again, maybe at halftime. I really don't have an idea that he, why he was there. Hey, you're both advised by the same person now, Al Heyman, that you're just to say, I want Floyd again. My thinking is, uh, uh, my plan is uh, one at a time. All I can say is, uh, can, can we leave that question hanging, question mark, until January 19th? So we can ask you that question January 20th. <laughs> <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs>